with almost 500 sessions at Next 2018, it's understandable that you couldn't get to them all. So if you didn't see building Go applications for the open cloud, then stay tuned because here's the rewind. Building a cloud native application in our modern times means embracing one key concept, embrace the open cloud. This really means to write your code, application, and systems such that you can easily move it between providers without needing to worry about heavy lifting. Focusing on this lets you utilize the strengths of each cloud provider while not being at the mercy of vendor lock-in, not to mention the improved resilience against provider downtime. Unfortunately, this is much easier said than done. At a high level, most clouds look the same. But at a low level, things are drastically different. Each cloud has their own provider-specific services, unique APIs, specific semantics, and, in general, a different mental model about how to architect, deploy, and manage your cloud-native application. That can make for a lot of differences. Kubernetes is one of the tools that helps address this, but it's not a complete solution. While Kubernetes does a great job at abstracting away the underlying compute infrastructure differences between providers, it doesn't extend into the realm of database storage, log aggregation, runtime configuration, testing, and so on and so on. So what do you do about all that stuff? Well, this is where GoCloud library comes in. GoCloud is an open source project written entirely in Golang, which provides generic APIs for commonly used services, such as blob storage, runtime variables, MySQL database access, and an HTTP server configured with tracing, request logging, and health checks. Using the abstraction in GoCloud lets you take your application from being tightly integrated into a specific cloud vendor to a more open and generic platform. This removes very tight coupling and gives your application better portability and flexibility. And that's one of the ways you can really embrace the open cloud. To help show off the power of GoCloud, the talk dives into a live demonstration. Ross and Eno show off a step-by-step -step walkthrough of how awesome the GoCloud project is, so you'll definitely want to check that out. If you'd like to see the full talk, check out the link in the description below. And don't forget to subscribe to the Cloud YouTube channel for more great Next Rewind content. Thanks for watching. <laughs>